In the Baylor match, we talked about it a little bit after that, that, that expectation of how they played in that match is the expectation the coaching staff has for this team. And I think being able to win that close game against Baylor, and they just played really, really well, has, has shown them how talented they really are. And I think tonight they really came out and put it on display again. What does it signify for the program coming out? Uh, you know, it's the first time we've ever swept them, and, and that's not a bad team at all, you know. That's a team that went five with Duke not very many days ago and, and really pushed Miami. So that's a good team that we beat tonight. Uh, like it, It's big for our program to show that we're continuing to move forward. The first time that you faced them, you did go up until five sets, and now it was three. What was the difference? Uh, you know, one playing in front of this home crowd is awesome, you know. Every time we got a little bit tight, the crowd started getting into it. One or two points stretched to four or five point lead really quick with the crowd behind us. And lastly, you had Edgar break a record. I mean, what, is, what comes to mind when you hear Edgar? Uh, she's just been so steady for us for four years. Uh, and and to, to break a blocking record, she came in here not, not expecting to play middle. And, and we saw her block one time in practice, and we're like, you're going to be a middle the next four years. And she's really embraced that and has really grown as a middle blocker and uh, couldn't be happier for her to go in the record books. It's a historic night for you. You did break a record. How does one break a record like this? I don't know. I guess hard work and coming every day and working hard, doing what I'm supposed to do. Your coach did mention that initially you weren't supposed to play this position and he made, he made a change. What was going through your head when he made that change? Um, I just wanted to play, so wherever you put me, that's where I was going to be. And lastly, we know you do have a tournament Friday coming up. How will you prepare yourself for this tournament? We'll just get back into practice, do what we do, and prepare for the next game because it's going to be a big one on Friday.